I'm Tucker. And I'm James. This is Four Hands Bowling. Today we have a review of one of the newer releases by Hammer, the Radioactive Vibe. It is a ball with the HK22 cover stock because it's Brunswick in 2023. That's kind of all they're putting out. This one is a the solid one. It's a uh, some solid. It's pretty. It's supposed to be entry level, but I believe it's kind of that middle range. It feels more strong than a hustle. In my opinion. Yeah, and for the $109 price tag, the movement on this ball is quite a lot. You would oh, not expect it. It's for unbeatable that, for that price. price. But uh, yeah, enough talk about it. Let's get to throwing. I got farther than I thought. All right, I'm standing on 30. I'm going to throw it to like the 8 4 board range and see if it strikes. You know what? Yeah, it struck. It came back, and I could not say I expected that. Right, I moved about five right, and I'm gonna not throw it on the gutter. I'm gonna try to get straight in front of me and see if it'll stay. It's it's chugging. It's going for an entry level ball. It's going. I'm moving another five right, and I'm gonna see how fast I can get it, and then he'll strike. He'll strike. Wow. All right, I'm gonna just move another five right, and if it strikes, it strikes. I mean. Oh my, it's such a good ball for the price. This thing is insane. Switching bowlers over to me. I'm spending about 35 and see what happens. That's a good shot. There we go. This ball is just so good. All right, I moved it about six left. Moving my target about two left and uh, see what happens. That's a good shot. Boom. Money. Same spot as the last shot. Good shot. Boom. Ooh, that's got to come back. Oh, solid eight. Call me Randy Peterson. Although this ball has just incredible motion, very clean motion through the lanes. Especially for the price point, it's got a fair amount of hook for the $110 price tag. Switching bowlers one more time. This is Tucker. Standing on about board 32. I'm going to try to get it to about... 13 at the arrows, 8 at the break point. Little inside. Oh, wow! That moved a lot. I That hit a little light. I'm going to move about a board left to keep my target the same. Okay, that was really bad. But it's still struck. That was a lot of movement, despite getting it out about five boards further than I wanted it to. It still came back and slammed the pocket. All right, this time I'm going to throw a good shot. I'm going to do the same line, but throw it better. That's pretty good. Oh! Ooh. That one got to the dry a little straighter than I wanted it to. Um, it overhooked. I really like the motion of this ball. We've been talking about it the entire video, but the $109 price tag is amazing. It gives you that higher end ball reaction for the lower end ball price, and I really like that. So to test that, I'm going to move about five boards right and throw it over boards 16, 17. Just see how far I can really take this. 
That's inside. Flat seven, but most balls would not even come back from that. This is probably one of the most versatile balls that I have thrown in a long, long time. And for that price tag, you simply cannot beat that. That was our review of the Radioactive 5 by Hammer James. What did you think of this ball? It's for $109. It's unbelievably strong. I mean, I stepped up there at 30 and I didn't think it would come back. I thought I would either leave a bucket or a 10 pin or something. And it struck. I mean, I move right, do you strike? Move left, do you strike? I move most places. And I think only once or twice did it cross the hip pin. Which surprised me that it was that strong in Brooklyn. Um, all around, for the price point, this thing is amazing. Yeah, and it's not just a one trick pony. It's not just super strong, but if you have to miss play straighter, it's useless. That's not the case at all. It is insanely versatile. So if you need to move farther inside the can, if you need to move farther outside and play more angle, you can absolutely do that. It is a very strong ball. It's insanely versatile, which was very surprising to me because I heard it being very very strong I did not expect it to be as versatile as it was because I played it a little bit of straight over an angle it hit the pocket a little light and then I moved about I want to say seven boards to the right and it still came back in the pocket left flat seven but it hit the pocket and it almost got that out I mean if you're a novice, if you're getting to want your first hook ball, if you're looking for something for dry lanes, if you just want another ball, this thing is unbeatable for the price point. Um, it reminds me of both the reactive purple hammer and the phase for $50, $60 less. This thing is just insane, and I definitely am going to pick this up for myself. Yeah, big recommend from all three of us, both us two and third the one, one over there. The one, the one over there cannot join us for the end show. But, he, but yeah, that's uh, <laughs> that's it. That's it for the. That's it for us. Thank you all for tuning in. This has been Tucker and James with Four Halves Bowling. Make sure to uh, look in the description because we got a Discord server that is brand new. We're still implementing things. So if you have any recommendations for things we should add or implement, make sure you put that down in the comments below because it is completely brand new. By the time that we are uploading this video, the Discord server has been up for less than 24 hours, so it's still super new. But that's about it. Thank you all for watching. Stay tuned for more 4 House Bowling because we have a lot more stuff planned in the future. We'll be back later. See you. All right, Tucker time to throw some, no, Tucker time. Tucker time. Tucker time. Tucker time. Yeah, enough talk about it. Let's get to throwing. I got farther than I thought. Don't just stand there. Don't just do something. Thanks for watching. Thank you.